Well, all right. It's time to go off to Neverland, everybody. And it's fitting that the youngest protagonist now is heading off to Neverland. I'm sure he's going to have a swell time. Combat level 7. <laughs> what could go wrong? We are a much lower level than Terra was, so we're probably actually going to die a lot. <laughs> or at least not have an easy time of it. Tinkerbell needs to get a longer dress, gotta say. Woohoo! It's Neverland! I just can't wait. We got a lot of commands we gotta level up here. Oh hey, Mickey's here! Now that's unexpected. Disney characters going to other Disney worlds that are not their own? What will they think of next? Move it. <laughs> Vanitas, what are you doing here? Uh-oh, Tinkerbell's getting ready to kick us in the face. Who are you? Name's Ventus. But everybody just calls me Ven. Huh. Guess when I sat down to rest, I must have fallen asleep. Don't sleep while Where, hoverboarding. Where'd you come from? Well, you see. Hmm? All right, all right, we're going. So long, Ben. Hey, Did you say? Where are you guys off to? King saw a shooting star, and we're going to go hunt it down. A shooting star? You mind if I come along? Of course not. But you got to agree to follow us. Yeah, it's uh, right over. Tinkerbell's like, I don't think so. That way, by the Indian camp. Ready, man? Forward, march. Okay. Ven actually could be a lost boy of his own. All right, here we are in Neverland. Oh, it's a good thing. <laughs> wow, it's a good thing I checked our commands. We got a lot of them up to the max rank. Ooh, yeah, we got Blitz from For Fortune Street last time. Let's go level that up. We got to keep leveling up a Fire Dash because I want to meld that with something. Oh, wow, we got a lot of commands that are maxed out. We never actually did equip Tornado Strike, did we? That's going to be important. We got Fire Surge as well. Let's start leveling up our Crawling Fire. Oh yeah, we got Blizzagas! I don't really care about the Aurora, I want the Blizzagas. Break time, whatever. Doesn't really matter. Do we have any... we don't. Oh, but we do have Stopra! Yes, please. And we got Pulse Bomb equipped, wonderful. Can we find a shop around here, please? I could really go for a shop. Because I got a lot of commands that I want to buy. Man, this is Ven with the boosted attack power of the Stitch D-Link. This is embarrassing. Really hoping for uh, another D-Link flower. That would be wonderful. Look at how little damage we're dealing. But it's hard to believe as it is, Ven is still a better character than Terra. Especially when it comes to the uh, bonus boss fights. Alright, no level up for the Stitch D-Link. Wonderful. Okay, so we landed back here, but it didn't let us explore around. That means that there must be some treasure chests waiting back here. Rainbow sticker! Hooray! Whoa. Oh yeah, let's use Pulse Bomb. Haven't shown this off yet. It's an interesting one. It's kind of unique. I mean, you gotta time the X button, like, with a lot of them. But instead of just shooting a bunch of stuff out, it, like, creates pulse vortexes, which is kind of interesting. Oh my gosh! 
Literally had to summon Stitch in order to avoid dying. Alright, cool. Blitz and Fire Dash leveled up. That's just great. This is gonna sound weird, but I'm actually gonna level up a regular old arrow. Also, what finished command do we have? Ah, Airbud Best Boy, that's right. We gotta keep using that one. Alright, let's skedaddle. Maybe I should have leveled up then a little bit more. Oh yeah, let's finally use Tornado Strike, which you got all the way back in the Enchanted Dominion. That's kind of cool. Oh boy, Fever Pitch. I also haven't really ever used the stop commands. Oh my gosh! I don't have any cures equipped, so I'm gonna hope for one of these enemies to drop a D-Link bonus. We already fit in with Peter Pan in the game. We can already glide. Yeah. Alright, come on. Give me a D-Link flower already. I, what I should have done is I should have gone back to, like, Dwarf Woodlands or something. Because it doesn't... How strong the enemy is does not make any difference with regards to whether they drop a D-Link flower or not. It ol the only thing that matters is just the number of enemies you kill. Anytime you kill an enemy, there's a set chance that they will drop a D-Link flower. So I should just be hitting the weak enemies to level up my remaining D-Links. I also still need to get the Pete D-Link. Never got that in all of my adventures in Fortune Street. Or Command Board, I guess it's technically called. There we go. Actually, wait. We need to go back to Mermaid Lagoon. There's a bunch of treasure chests that I didn't even get any of. Oh, well. Oh, boy. Hi, Peter. Who do we have here? Never seen you before. I'm Ventus. Call me Vent. Well, if you say so. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Tension. Peter Pan, you're a little stinker, aren't you? I don't suppose you'd want to capture some real pirate treasure. Real pirate treasure? Sure. Well, guess who caught sight of Hook right when he was stashing his treasure? What do you say we sneak in and grab it? Oh, boy! Let's go, let's go! Ow! Oh! Tinkerbell? What's gotten into you? We were all supposed to go hunt for a shooting star together. Forget that. Pirate treasure is way more fun. <laughs> Tink, you're coming with us. Well, that's no way to respond to an invitation. Come on, Ben. You're a better sport than her, right? I'd I like don't know. Join you, but first, I want to find the shooting star. He's like, what? <laughs> Are you crazy? Well, Tinkerbell's gonna like that. Peter Pan's like, whatever. That's when they run off and confront Terra. Pretty sure that happens at the same time that this does. But I'm just gonna sneak into Peter Pan's hideout and take his treasure while we're here. He was such a little stinker to us. Oh yes, and the shop is here. Wonderful. Mega Ether. Fleeting Crystal. Don't really need either of those. Okay, with our money, there's a bunch of stuff that we're gonna need. Uh, I'm gonna buy two blocks. I'm also gonna buy two air slides. I'm also going to buy a dodge roll. <laughs> Because, yes, there's stuff that we can, uh, meld with all of that. And now we've got no money. Great. <laughs> well, let's start melding our stuff together, shall we? So first up... Rats, we have to use our max level air slide. Sliding dash plus air slide will give us homing slide. And if we attach an abounding crystal to that... That is not what was supposed to happen. Never mind, I read it wrong. Great. Well, we get Homing Slide with Link Prize Plus. So homing Slide. Use Homing Slide to quickly close in on an enemy. Pre just press square in the middle of a combo. That seems strange. All right. Well, another thing we can do is we can meld our Dodge Roll with our Thunder Surge to get Thunder Roll. And if we attach an Abounding Crystal to this, we get Thunder Roll with EXP Walker. Yeah, we haven't gotten EXP Walker yet. Thunder Roll is going to be an interesting one. That's for sure. Meanwhile, we've got some blocks. We're gonna meld one block with a poison edge to get poison block. And it turned into, oh my gosh, it turned into bio barrage. That's amazing. We're normally supposed to buy that from the uh, 
<laughs> from the Mirage Arena, but wow, that's a really low chance of happening. That's actually kind of amazing. Okay, well, I think we still have Poison. Yeah, we will block with Poison to actually get Poison Block. And I did not attach a Crystal because I don't really want to level up Poison Block. Well, that's pretty great. Man, so now we got Bio Barrage, Photon Charge, and Lightning Ray. We got Lightning Ray as well from a random... Okay, that's amazing. Okay. I like... Actually, no. Let's go Photon Charge. I really like Photon Charge. Then if we go to our Action Commands, we are going to replace... Where's our Dodge Roll? Oh, yeah. We're going to equip Thunder Roll. Start getting that EXP Walker going. Uh, where's Homing Slide? Here's Homing Slide. Can we equip Air Slide as well? Yes, we can! Booyah! Oh, this is amazing. Another thing we can do is now I think we can meld our arrow with our Aurora. Our Aurora? No, we can't. We need to get our arrow to max level before we can do that. It's weird. Sometimes a not max level command can be melded with another max level non max level command, and sometimes it can't. It's very strange. We're gonna buy a stop. Maybe we can sell some of our items. Ice cream does not sell for very much. We'll sell some uh, high potions, though. Those aren't going to be terribly useful. We could also sell, potentially, two of our Auroras. I don't think we need this many. That's fine. I'd rather have the cash. Now we can buy another block. We can meld that block with the Stun Edge to get Stun Block. Beautiful. Okay, so that was a lot of stuff that went on, but it's all for a good cause. So now Thunder Roll? <laughs> Thunder Roll literally makes our Dodge Roll actually deal damage. Thunder Base damage as well. And it staggers the enemy throughout it, and it builds our Command Gauge up really fast as well. Now, you might be thinking, why would you ever not use Thunder Roll? Well, it's simple. While Thunder Roll is a great offensive command, it's nowhere near as good defensively as Dodge Roll. Dodge Roll, when it's at max level, will quite literally give you in pretty much infinite invincibility frames during it. This doesn't grant nearly as many. But it's still funny. As you can see, he just can't do anything. Nice job, Ventus. And that's the power of the Thunder Roll. A balloon letter. How wonderful. I don't think this is the way to the- Oh, doggone it! Because I missed out on the mermaid lagoon treasure, I can't go back now. Great. Hey, we're back- we're back here. At the gully. A bounding crystal. Well, how nice. Oh, yes! We finally get the map of Neverland. How wonderful. I don't think this is the way to the Indian camp. Oh no, boo hoo. Okay, hang on. One thing I'm gonna do, I'm actually gonna leave the world partway through. Because I wanna get my D-Links to max level. And for that, actually, we're gonna go to Castle of Dreams. Technically, battle level's a little higher than Dwarf Woodlands, but here we can get on the Yarn Ball and just wreck everything. And I think that's gonna be the best way of going. Plus, there's a sticker here that we can grab now. Well, I'm sure there's a sticker we can get in pretty much every world now that we've got, like, max level high jump and super glide, but you know what I mean. There we go! Now we will finish leveling up the Zack D-Link. That's another one that we haven't leveled up yet. Wow, first try. Cool. <laughs> Man, Neverland was just being real stingy with the D-Link flowers. Whereas Cinderella's world is like, here, have them for free. We don't care. We, lo we love it when you level stuff up. <laughs> I love getting these on the slash. They really just went all out with that finish command, and I love it. All right, well, now that we got our maxed out D-Links, let's continue on through the wonderful world of Neverland. Star Shard? We're gonna need that. 
A shooting star and a pixie. Must be me birthday. <laughs> you look friendly. Let Tinkerbell go. Huh, one of Peter Pan's brats. Well, tell that cowardly sparrow if he wants his precious Tinkerbell back, he'd best meet me at Mermaid Lagoon. Stop! <laughs> Captain Hook, how Scream. could you? Captain Hook is the best villain. Oh boy, now we get to defeat all the unversed. It would be my pleasure. Because now we get Thunder. extra dealing points. Thunder. And we have learned the power up with the Ohana. Yeah. Oh boy, time for the Ohana beat. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Worst rhythm game ever. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. Ridiculous. All right, you gotta go. Okay, this just got a lot more dangerous. There we go. What the heck? They timed that perfectly. Also, that guy didn't drop anything. No health. No Link Prizes, nothing! I was trying to get either health to get health back or Link Prizes so I could D-Link again. But neither of them worked! You will die for that. Better play best boy! You better believe it! Surely we gotta be close to Rama's judgment as a finisher, right? We've deal it, we've Apparently Stop Rook takes us into the Cyclone Command style. Seems interesting. I also forgot that I have Renewal Barrier. Which, man, that would be helpful. I D-Linked Stitch! I was mashing the triangle button. I think, yeah, whereas Terra was disgustingly overleveled in Neverland, I think Ventus is kind of underleveled. Either that or this is what Critical Mode is just supposed to be like. There we go, there's Rama's Judgment. I guess it counted my fail at failed attempts. My failed attempts apparently kept adding to the counter. You guarded the wrong way, Ventus, you little butt! He literally turned around, did a 180, without me telling him to, literally just so he would get hit and die. I wasn't even locked onto any guy back there. I was... That was so stupid. That should not have happened. There's the XP walker working for me at last. Ah, Thunder Surge. I love you. No, okay. I did not want to do the freaking Aloha BD. This is why I hate... Stitch's second finisher. It takes so long to go through. It's like a one minute long finisher almost. Like who the heck thought this was a good idea for a finisher? Especially since you can't move while doing it. Thank goodness you're invincible during it, but like... Come on, this is very dumb. Okay, I've had enough Stitch for the time being. Not until I can change his finisher back to the random beam. Oh, 
Oh boy, now the monkey boys arrive. The real fun begins. Oh yes, I love Photon Charge. Stopper is actually helping us out a lot here. There we go, wow. That mob fight took a lot longer to beat than I would have wanted. Holy moly. Told you, critical mode is hard. Oh no, what do we do now? If only I hadn't died three times. Have you ever wonder what stars are? Where light comes from? <laughs> Remember that one night that we actually had a good relationship with each other? Oh God, that was below. great. Peter, help! Tinkerbell's been pixie napped. They left really? too late. Hook's gonna pay for this. He said to meet him at Mermaid Lagoon. Gotta be an ambush. Huh, that old codfish thinks he's clever. Hey, I'm going too. Well, we have to hurry. Can you keep up? You bet. <laughs> you bet. I can super glide. I can only regular glide. Do, 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 do. How wonderful. Okay. Stopper has reached its maximum level. That's great. Okay, Rama's Judgment. Gotta rename that. I just decided to go simple here. Zeus! <laughs> yes, Zeus is very f fantastic. Alright. Now we can finally meld our Ar arrow and Aurora together. With a hungry crystal, we get a Rogo with treasure magnet. Hooray! It's about time. Fire Dash plus Fundara with a Fleeting Crystal. Oh look, Thunder Surge of Attack Haste. I love that. <laughs> Aerial Slam plus Blitz. With a Wellspring Crystal, which gives us our Sarcanum with Air Combo Plus. Oh yes. That's right. Our Sarcanum is in this game. And it's great. Love it. Alright, let's start getting that Aroga leveled up. Binding Strike plus Blizzago with a Shimmering Crystal, which gives us Deep Freeze with Blizzard Scream. Because, why not? We can't equip- actually, okay, we can't equip it. I don't really want Tornado Strike anymore. It's alright. It's not fantastic, though. Let's go Blizzard Strike instead. Or Deep Freeze, sorry. I don't think there's any treasure over here. Nope. We should probably actually just start walking everywhere, just so EXP Walker starts kicking in. That might actually be the smart thing to do. Oh, hey. Hey, you all. Oh, 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 what's this? Oh, you in so much trouble now. Oh, man. Our Zarkanum is amazing. Aroga is not great. But that's okay. We don't need Aroga to be amazing. We just need it so we can meld it with something else. And make something actually good. Oh, yes! Oh, our Zarkana is amazing. Oh boy! My two Blizzagas are at max level now. Which means we've mastered the Blizzard boosts! Oh, right. We got some money. Oh my gosh, it's Esnu Esnua. <laughs> oh, we could just buy Mind Square. That could be interesting. I'm gonna buy two Magnets because I gotta get some Magnigas. We don't have Blackout, so I guess I'll buy that as well. We don't have bind, like the worst command, I'll buy that. Remember, to complete the command collection, we've got to get at least one of every type of command. Alright, well I'm going to immediately start leveling up those magnets right away. Get those to max level so I can meld them to get Magnaga. Which I'm, not only is really good, but I'm also going to need those in order to meld something even better. Airbud, best boy. 
actually, wait. What am I doing? Stitch, you can give me a- No, wait, shoot. No, I forgot. I forgot to change Stitch's finisher. That was what I was supposed to do. Who's spying on us? Whoa. Uh Cannon fire? Where's it coming from? On the water. Over there. Uh oh. This isn't much of a trap, I gotta say. Hey, it's Tinkerbell! Tink, it's you! And you're all right. What? A strange fellow with a funny looking sword has <laughs> That's Terra. I gotta stop that cannon. Okay, I'll go after Hook. Right. Tink, if you would. Thanks, Tinkerbell, but I didn't need Pixie Dust. I just sequence what? broke. <laughs> it's Pixie Dust. Bet you feel lighter now, don't you? Now you can fly too, Ventus. I already could fly. Obtain Glide. It's actually a downgrade of Super Glide. But we do actually have to level it up if we want to get some of the bonus commands in the game. But not right now. Super Glide is just too much fun. The Dale sticker. I want to get what's in here. Aroga! <laughs> cool. I literally just melded it, but I guess I could always use another one. Because Ventus is the windy guy. Actually, this is probably not the best idea to use Ars Arcanum on a rock face. That did not deal nearly as much damage as I had hoped. Why is he still playing the generic non-enemy combat music when I'm fighting enemies? Oh boy! Crawling Fire just leveled up, folks. You know what this means. Vision Fireaga, Crawling Fire. We're getting Mega Flare. We'll give it a Pulsing Crystal so it gives us Finish Boost. Alright, well... Okay. Sorry, Deep Freeze, but Mega Flare takes priority. 100% it does. <laughs> now, before I forget anymore... Stitch, you are going back to the random beam. We just dodge roll into it over and over again, and boom, broken rock. Or we can just let Captain Hook's cannon destroy it. I'm disappointed the Mega Flare is not insta killing everything. It's supposed to. Treasure Raid! Oh boy! I guess I didn't have to meld it after all. Homing Slide got a level up. Well, how nice. Oh boy, our magnets are max level. That's great. Fire. Hey, we unlocked Air Flare 2 as a new finish command. I do like Neverland. Win. That's not the right button. <laughs> Fyraga. Magnet Magnera with a Soothing Crystal to give us Magnego with HP boost. And then we're going to do the exact same thing. Because Ven needs more HP. Now, while I could equip both of them, I think it's better to equip Deep Freeze and then just one of them. Also, if we go to our abilities... Okay, that, get, that will give us our final HP boost that we need. That's great. We don't have... Uh, we don't have Dark Screen. We also don't have... Is that Item Boost? Oh, yeah. We don't have Item Boost or cube, Cure Boost at all. We don't have Fire Screen, Thunder Screen, or Dark Screen. We don't have all the combo pluses, but that's okay. We've got the main important skills. 
The ones that I was actually worried about. Oh, hey! The ice cream boys. Oh no, they disappeared before I could Magnago them again. Shoot. <laughs> Ventus wasn't watching where he was going, and he just rolled off a cliff. Also, we now have Air Flare number two. Knock enemies into the air with a flurry of wind-powered attacks and a spin attack. Stun some foes. Alright, well we gotta rename this. Air Bud is no longer best boy. You hear that? It's the wind. That's what we're gonna do instead. Heck yes. Heck yes. I'll be honest, that didn't have a lot to do with the winds. It's more just a Keyblade Flurry attack again. A little bit disappointed about that. Oh boy, our air slide got a level up. Yay, a strength level up. Kinda needed that. Oh hey, we're back at the cove. And unless I'm mistaken, I believe we are about to fight the boss, so I'm going to re-equip a different deck for this. Because Mega Flare and Deep Freeze really aren't going to help in this fight in the slightest. So, Thunder Surge, we got to equip that. We're also going to need maybe, like, a Kiraga of some kind. Yeah, I think that would be very nice to have. I'll keep the Magnaga, but... Oh, I know. Hang on a second. We got Stop and Stopper now leveled up, so we can meld them together to get Stopaga. With a Wellspring Crystal, Stopaga with Air Combo Plus. I think we'll equip Stopaga as one of those. And you know what? We'll go with Fire Surge, because Surge attacks are really good. Hey, Hook. How you doing? <laughs> Why are your eyes gray? Alas, and so passeth a worthy opponent to think that his would be such an inglorious end. Uh. <laughs> At last, that scurvy brat will never trouble me again. I wouldn't be so sure of that, Hook. Swoggle me eyes. <laughs> Don't tell me! <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, Jimmy! Blast that Peter Pan! Oh, is that salt? Oh, it's TikTok! I don't think so. Ooh. Ben is serious. Yes. <laughs> Defeat Captain Hook. Yes, Captain Hook is the boss of Neverland Preventus, and this is gonna be fun. Does he get affected by Magna God? No, he doesn't. That was the reversal slash. <laughs> Stopka is actually quite uh, effective against Captain Hook. Oh my gosh, wait, with Stopka we can literally just indefinitely stun lock him in place. This doesn't seem fair. Oh, hi, uh, I don't really want to get hit by TikTok myself. Thankfully, TikTok doesn't really care about eating us. He's just like, hey, Captain Hook's in the water. This is going to be a good dinner. Uh oh. Uh oh. He avoided our stop. Darn it, he's avoiding it now. Eat my Arsarcan- okay. 
didn't care about that. Wow! He deflected our Thunder Surge. Help me, Aqua. All right, how do you like some teleport balls, bro? That's what I thought. Uh-oh. Don't worry, guys. Had to you forgotten about Aqua's secondary ability for her D-Link. Auto life! Yes. Now we can our Sarcanum him while he's stopped. <laughs> Oh yes, we're in the Wing Blade Command style. Oh yeah, eat my Wing Blade, Captain Hook. <laughs> Fire Surge is actually potentially even more useful against Captain Hook than Thunder Surge is. I'm just saying something. All right, Captain Hook, I think this is your end. <laughs> Booyah! <laughs> oh, man, that's such a fun fight. I love that one. <laughs> Captain Hook is one of those fights that's tough but fair. I like tough but fair. In the drink. <laughs> Ventus is like, oh boy. Oh boy. What we brought. <laughs> Ahoy! It's a treasure chest. Treasure. Yay! Look, the same chest I told you about. We snatched it right from Hook's hiding place. Huh? How come it's empty? Oh, uh, sorry, but we lost it all the treasures. Oh well, that's too bad. Aw, uh, who needs it? It was probably just full of dumb old jewels or doubloons or something anyways. Captain Hook's like, how dare you? We could just put what we treasure in there instead, if you wanna. Yeah, that's perfect. Instead of filling it up with jewels and gold and stuff, we'll put in what's truly special to us, the real riches. <laughs> Our friends. <laughs> Pan puts all his friends in the box. Apparently they value wooden swords and guns over... Money. What are you putting in, Ben? I'm putting in my two cents. <laughs> Pennies. <laughs> I, well, there's this ice cream stick I have. How about this? Hmm, what is it? It's just something that one of my best friends gave me. You still have that wooden keyblade so it's on like hand? a keepsake, huh? You sure you want to part with something that special? Yep. I don't, I don't need, need it. it. If I've got Terra and Aqua. That's an I if, though. Memories are still ahead. Didn't you guys end your friendship right, with each other? Ben. Next time you visit, we'll have an even bigger chest waiting. Enough for all those treasures and lots more. Okay, it's a deal. <laughs> Captain Hook is like, I got me treasure chest back. What's this? Wooden swords? Where's me? Where's me treasure? Oh, Tinkerbell. Tink. I'm pretty sure that belongs to a friend of mine. Do you think maybe I could hang on to it? She's like, nope. Now, Tink. Thank you. Oh no! It's too bright! We disappeared. He's gone! Look, the light! 
Now we get to use the Star Shard. Don't worry, men. No matter where that light takes him, Ben will always have friends waiting to meet him. Cheesy, but true. We forged a D-Link with Peter Pan! Heck yeah, and we get the Pixie Petal Keyblade. Alright. This also explains why in Free 5 8 over two days, Tinkerbell seems to know Roxas because she knew Ven, who looks exactly like him. Cool little cutaway. And we unlocked the command board for ne I already had the command board for Neverland. Gorge. The king must be pretty far away by now. Hey, it's my buddies! Goofy and Donad. Love them. <laughs> Gorsh, he's, like him. he seems kind of different somehow. Uh -huh. Look, that feller's got the star shard the king borrowed. King? Oh, you must be talking about Mickey. I saw him. What? <laughs> huh? Hey, take it easy. Let's go. <laughs> Who the heck are you two? Didn't you watch classic Disney cartoons? What the heck is Disney? Never mind. <laughs> Yay, now Ventus finally gets to go to the Mysterious Tower. Terra went there really early in his story, but Ventus goes there quite late in his. <laughs> Even though they already escorted us inside, it didn't actually take us there. So now if we go to our Keyblades... Pixie Petal lowers our strength but gives us a big boost to magic. I actually think we're gonna go with that. It has really short range though, look at that. Wellspring Crystal. And Magnaga! Oh, I'm always happy to have another Magnaga. Oop -a -doop. Mega Magic Recipe, alright. <laughs> Don't run up the stairs? Yen said, sir, we just got a clue as to where the king might be. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, Ventus. Huh? Ericus has told me much about you. If I am not mistaken, you were ordered to return home. Well, sir... But then I did it. <laughs> no matter. Huh? Mickey has difficulty following directions, too. <laughs> That's why we got along so well. Where is this clue to Mickey's whereabouts? I got it! No, Donald, don't you mean I got it! <laughs> this feller, Benquist, uh, Ventilate, uh, uh, Veggie, uh... Just a red. Sure. That's what I usually go by. Red had it when you got here. Please explain. Well, you see, Captain Hook was shooting at us with cannons. What the heck are you talking about? I'm getting there. I ran into Mickey, but we got sent flying into the light. I don't know where he went. He wasn't in the same world as the one where I found that. As I thought, Mickey has been hurling himself from one world to the next. That explains why I could not discern his location. You can now, can't you? Yes, I can. Ooh, ominous Yen Sid powers. <laughs> he is in Disney Town. Oh no, he's in the Badlands. Where'd you go? Is he okay? There is a dark and powerful force that is interfering with my magic. Just tell us where the king is, Mr. Yen Sid, sir, and me and Donald will go right there and save him. You two, that may not be adequate. <laughs> you two, but Donald always dies. <laughs> ah, come on! But I'm the captain of the king's royal knights. I'll find him. I recognize the place we saw. 
Yeah, we need party members. So that doesn't mean you don't have to. I can't risk putting his friends in danger. It's literally their jobs, but all right. I swear I'll bring him back safe. Very well, Ventus. We will leave it to you. <laughs> do, do, do. Forged a D-Link with Donald and forged a D-Link with Goofy. Yep, yeah, we get to D-Link with Donald and Goofy in Ven's story. Terra didn't get that. Terra just got to D-Link with Maleficent. Oh, yes. The Donald and Goofy D-Links are fun. Not sure how necessarily how good they are, but they are fun. And speaking of fun, let's go and level up those D-Links right now. First, a quick look. So, obviously, we got the Peter Pan D-Link, jumping attacks, and the sword belt. Donald, D-Link with Donald to change your arsenal. Command deck, fire attacks, finish, blast off fireworks. And Goofy, D-Link with Goofy to change your arsenal. Command attack is charge at enemies, and then your finish is you smash into enemies while spinning like a top. It's, it's kind of interesting. Donald gives you a lot of fire-based magic commands, and Goofy is a lot of, like, the dash attacks. I can't show it off. Donald gives us like Fyraga, Wazaga, Fundaga right from the get go. Oh my gosh, yes. And our first Donald dealing prize is Magic Boost, which, when we have that, will increase the power of our magic attacks. Oh yeah. Oh wow. And we already got to Donald's second level. So now we get Shell as well, which decreases the damage we take from magic attacks. And now, the finisher, we basically launch a whole bunch of fireworks out. Some of them take more button presses to launch than others. It's fun. Well, I like the yeah. Donald D-Link. Unfortunately, this means because we used his second finisher, we need to actually change him back to use his first finisher again. Because otherwise, the game just will not register that we did that. And that will not let us get 100% completion in the journal. Now we can deal with Peter Pan. Oh, wow. Castle Dreams, best place to level up Venge D-Links, for sure. Wow, that was so fast. <laughs> now we D-Link Goofy. Wow, first try. Protect, this will decrease the damage we take from physical attacks while we have that. That's pretty nice. I like how Goofy's D-Link is like divided up into specific bars. Instead of just one giant one. <laughs> like it's a charge meter. Which is fitting since Goofy's attacks are charge attack fiend. Goofy spin! It's like the Goofy tornado. I love that finisher. That's really fun. Okay, now the second D-Link flower is being... Nope, never mind. There we go. Booyah. And now we get Stun Boost, which basically allows us to more easily stun enemies. And here we get Goofy Turbo as a finisher. Harder to control, it's basically like his, um, Whirl... can't remember if it's his Knock Smash or his Whirly Goof, uh, limit attack from Kingdom Hearts 2. It's fun regardless, though. Okay, now we gotta get Donald's initial finisher. Donald Flare. We still launch fireworks, but they're simple fireworks that only need one button press. As opposed to two. I actually think I prefer it to, uh... His secondary finisher. As much as I want to keep using Super Glide, I actually... Oh wait, never mind. Glide, you don't even need to level up, so never mind. Hey! So I played a round of Command Board, I got the Ragnarok uh, shot lock, which you can only get through here, and I forged the D-Link with Pete! 
And I literally ended that round of the command board with only two commands on the panel, on the panels. Because literally Terra and Aqua bought me out of every single other one. Every single other one. It was ridiculous. Well, I beat Cinderella and I got the two new things you can only get on the Cinderella board, the Meteor Shower and Focus Block. Technically you can get Meteor Shower by melding, but it's a very rare chance. And I wasn't pushing my luck. I also believe I will- Oh. Okay, one of my Firagas I got to max level. My Mega Flare I almost got to max level because I put like all of my money into it. Focus Block got to max level, so did Meteor Shower. That's amazing. Oh, I'm so happy. All right, can I buy another Aerial Slam? I can't, that's real expensive. All right, what can I sell? I'll sell one of my Elixirs, I don't need them all. I'll sell some of my Ethers. Where did I get all these Binding Strikes from? Well, I certainly don't need all of those. There we go, I would love to buy another Aerial Slam. Because I want to level that up. I'll, tell, I'll sell two of my Blizzagas. And those were Blizzagas that were max level with a, an ability attached to them, so that gives me a bunch of money. I'm going to buy a second Glide. Because we actually need that in order to meld together. We're going to meld one of those Glides with our Fyraga to get Fire Glide. Fire Glide is really weird. So... <laughs> Fire Glide. Hold circle in midair to cloak yourself in fire and glide. Enemies take damage on contact. It's a very, very weird ability. Can't say it's particularly good. It doesn't make you go very fast. And also, it barely deals damage to enemies. It's also hard to hit enemies with it. Okay, well, keep in mind, these are World 1 enemies that are dying immediately to it. I guess it looks kind of cool. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to equip it, because, like, why not? Out of the way, vent is coming through. Now we can get that ice cream sticker. How lovely. I actually want to take a look at our sticker album to see how many stickers... Okay, we're missing all three in the Radiant Garden. We're missing one in Disney Town, and that's it! Apart from the ones that are in the, uh... Keyblade Graveyard. There's Mickey. We get fireworks! Hooray! Actually, wait, was that the proper space for him? No, it was not. There we go, that's the proper space for him. Rainbow! It's Dale! And an ice cream. Uh, we'll put that on Ventus's cone. And we get Collision Magnet! Cool, that's a command I didn't have. Look at that triple scoop. UFO! There we go, and confetti. Where do you want the freaking confetti? No matter no matter where I put this dang confetti, it's not sparkling. Literally no matter where I put it. Okay, there we go. That was really picky. That was really picky, my goodness. Okay, we maxed out our Thunder Surge. We're gonna start leveling up our Aerial Slam. Along with our another Fire Dash. We also need to get Break Time up to max level too. Photon Charge is maxed out, cool. Let's level up Bio Barrage. 
Simple high jump to get that ice cream sticker. Oh yeah. Man, if only you could fuse Super Glide with Fire Glide. That would be the ultimate. But no. At the entrance to the gates of Hollow Bastion, we have a fireworks sticker. Oh boy, more fireworks. And here's the last sticker. We can just glide on into it from above. Boom. Oh, the Huey sticker. That's right, I thought there was one of those little ducklings missing from the picture. Now we can just add them to the book. Huey's freaking out. There we go. Huey's in just the right place. Another ice cream. We get salvation! Oh, that there's a command. Now Minnie's not glowing. Oh no, no, yes she is. Sweet. At this point, if we go to... Oh, we're missing one in Disney Town, that's right. Okay, we just need to get to 140 and we get Riven Mixer. Salvation is a new command and that's for Ventus only. I'll just go over a brief description of it. Salvation, perform a powerful spinning attack and hit enemies with lots of columns of light at once. You will also recover HP. It uses two slots. Yeah, that's a pretty good command. There's a reason that it costs two slots. Can I make any new ice cream now? Oop. I just used our Arcanum on the ice cream stand. Thanks for the ingredients! Nope. Nope. No, no new ice cream flavors. Okay, I don't exactly know where the extra sticker is, but I'm willing to bet we have to go into the sewer in order to reach it. Everything seems to be connected to the sewer in Disney Town. At least anything of value. Oh, and this means that we can power up the room by just rolling into it over and over again. <laughs> this is my favorite way to power up the machine. Yep, so the final sticker's over here. The chip sticker. Yay. Won't he be happy to be added to the sticker album? We're running out of space. I hope the remaining I hope the remaining stickers are small things that can go in the air. Otherwise, we're probably in trouble. We also missed two treasure chests here in Neverland, and I think they're both at the cove. Because we weren't actually able to explore the cove, it's just like, it's time for you to fight Captain Hook right now! And sure enough, here they are. A Mega Elixir? And a Mega Potion. Well, not great items, must admit. Oh, when did I unlock Heal Strike? I do not remember unlocking Heal Strike, but apparently I did. I decided to name this finish command after everybody's favorite ability from Star Wars, Force Healing. Not controversial at all. I'm gonna go back to the Ad Sid Free Thousand in order to start, because I'm gonna be getting a lot of money. Actually, no. No, I'm not going back to that. We're going back to the Winds of Change, because we're leveling up our commands right now. Alright, here's what I've been waiting for. Magnaga, Aroga, Shimmering Crystal gives us Tornado, with Cure Boost for some reason. But that's going to be good. Oh, Mega Flare is almost max level, and I think Ars Arcanum is getting there as well. And I can't wait to equip that in place of those. <laughs> yes, Wind Blade! Oh, Break Time might have reached max level as well. Yes, there is a reason I'm leveling up Break Time. Mega Flare has reached its maximum level. <laughs> So have Fire Dash and Break Time, that's wonderful. We're going to melt Fire Dash with Thunder Surge, which might sound weird, but trust me. Fire Dash, Thunder Surge, Fleeting Crystal give us Sonic Blade with Attack Haste. We still gotta get all of them Attack Hastes. Once again, this is the best room in Neverland to level grind. Sonic Blade's definitely not as good for Ventus as it is for Terra, but it's still respectable. Tornado, on the other hand. Remember the Tornado Slate from Chain of Memories? How good it was? Yeah, it's uh, pretty similar here as well. It's, it's fantastic. Oh, yes! Finally, Ventus has passed the threshold and he's no longer a weak little boy. Now he's now he's showing his stuff. Yeah, Tornado is a uh, really, really good slate. <laughs> or slate. It's a really good slate. It's also good as a command in this. Hear that? It's the winds of change. <laughs> <laughs> Magnaga plus Tornado. <laughs> what could stand against? Aerial Slam, Stopaga, Hungry Crystal. We get Time Splicer with HP Prize Plus. So, if you've played Kingdom Hearts Re Chain of Memories, I, I do not recommend it. I like the GBA one better. But if you have, 
You might know of a little incredibly broken slate called Lethal Frame. Yeah, this is basically the same theme. Inflict stop on enemies, then press triangle at the right times to perform a combo while teleporting. Uses two slots. It's, um, it's really good. It's also really, really cool. <laughs> It, it's so cool. Lethal frame, you basically freeze an enemy in place and then hit them a bunch of times, and then they take a bunch of damage, and then you can just keep spamming it over and over again if you've got the cards for it in Reach Chain of Memories. Here, obviously, because of its slow recharge, even with a huge amount of uh, haste abilities, it, you can't spam it, really, but it's still a really fun ability to use. So yeah, that that happens. That's really fun. <laughs> I love Time Splicer. <laughs> Again, even if even if a bunch of the commands in this game aren't maybe maybe they're not the most like practical, they still look really cool. And that's what it's really all about, isn't it? And man, okay, the magic stat from the from this keyblade is just carrying me. It's great. And I'm also digging the uh, double CP from Experiment 626's D-Link. Our Sarcamus reaches max level, so has Magnaga and Sonic Blade, and I think Fire Glide as well? Nope, Fire Glide has not. We can now start leveling up our Deep Freeze. I'm also gonna start leveling up a uh, Blizzaga. Oh, and Bio Barrage is max level. Cool. Now Lightning Ray, I guess, is the only shot lock we have left to level. Fire Glide has now reached max level, so now we can equip Super Glide instead. Sonic Blade and Tornado are now both max level. Excellent. I'm gonna level up another Magnaga. We can meld our Fire Up with our Stop to get Mind Square. Because we don't have that yet, somehow. We can get that with HP Prize Plus. We can now meld Blizzaga with Air Slide to get Ice Slide, and it came with Magic Haste for free, I guess. This also seems like a good uh, time to show off the Salvation uh, command. <laughs> yep. <laughs> That's a pretty fun one! <laughs> I love Salvation. It's kind of like the Holy Slate from um, Chain of Memories. Actually, Ventus has a lot of these commands that are the same as some of the slates that uh, Sora learns in Chain of Memories, which is really interesting. So remember when I said we were underleveled? I don't think we're underleveled anymore. Now we're level 30. I don't want to go too overboard with this before the final boss, but... Well, I'm going to my two cures. So I can meld those with the Kira's to get Kiraga. This is my remaining cash. I'm just gonna buy some Thunder Surges because um, it's the best command in the game. <laughs> Guess we might as well get Zero Gravago while we're here. Guess we'll go Soothing Crystal to get Item Boost because we don't have that yet. Just taking a look at our command connection. Can uh, collection. We're only missing three attack commands. We're missing free magic commands, we're missing some flavors of ice cream, and we're missing a bunch of the group commands. We now have all the action commands, we have all the block commands. We're actually missing one of these. Oh yeah, aerial recovery. We need to get that from the Mirage Arena, and we're missing one shot lock. Again, that's Ventus's ultimate shot lock that we need to get from the Mirage Arena as well. And we're missing one D-Link special. Actually, we're missing more than that. We've got Fruit Shot, we're missing the Rumble Rave for Pete. Then for finish commands, well, we're missing a couple of those. And we're missing some abilities. But other than that, we're doing pretty well for the command collection, I must say. All right, Binding Strike and Magnaga give us the Magnet Spiral. And we get Treasure Magnet with that. We're gonna meld our Curas with our Curas. With Shimmering Crystals to get the remaining Cure Boosts. We're also gonna meld Quick Blitz with Blizzar to get Blizzard Edge. And that's not what it said! It said that would give me Attack Haste, and it gave me Magic Haste. What a... Uh, all right, Aroga plus Treasure Raid gives us Wind Raid, and we get the Lucky Strike ability with that. Wind Raid! Throw the Keyblade at the enemy, letting the wind guide it towards your target for multiple hits. Yeah, that's exclusive to Ventus, in case you didn't know. Oh, I got another Quick Blitz. Can I actually... Oh, I can't even melt that. How wonderful. Okay, Strike Raid plus Thunder. Is this actually going to give me my final attack haste? Don't lie to me, <laughs> melding website. It said it will. There we go. Stun Edge with attack haste. I want that last attack haste. It's super important. Gotcha. Yay, eat my Wind Raid. 
It's basically judgment from Chain of Memory. I'm waiting for my Link prizes. Thank you. I also have come to realize that some of my remaining commands I don't have, I just need to buy from the shop. For example, Confusion Strike, I actually never got. So here, I'll just buy that. I also never bought Ignite from the store. Oh my gosh, I'm five gold short. Well, you know what? We're selling a single potion then. <laughs> now give me that Ignite. There we go. Magnet Spiral, Zero Gravica, Pulsing Crystal, Transcendence with the Combo Finisher Boost. Alright, it's time for, I believe, the final command to meld in the game, and it's probably the toughest command to meld. So, we need two ingredients. First, we need Wind Raid, and then we need Break Time. The two of these together will create... Faith. Ventus's final magic command, and Faith is basically a better version of Salvation. <laughs> if you can believe that. So, if we go over to Faith. Send out columns of light which devastate the enemies and recover HP at the same time. It's, it's basically just a more, a more powerful version of Salvation. And getting more than one of these is nearly impossible because it requires break time in order to meld this. And you get the one break time in the chest in the Pete Pinball Machine. But beyond that, if you want break time, you have to meld it. And it, you even... <laughs> With its one recipe, you only have a 10% chance of actually melding that. So, yeah, it's very difficult to get a bunch of them. But we have it now, and I can't wait to show it off, because man, is it good. <laughs> also surprised we have not gotten the next Ventus finish command, to be perfectly honest. I would have expected we would, but I guess not. Anyhow, once Faith actually charges up... Here we go. What's nice about Faith is that where Salvation heals you at the end of the attack, Faith heals you at the beginning. <laughs> Making it much more reliable for healing. Oh my gosh, Transcendence is good as well. Yay! Our Thunder Surges are max level. I think we're still going to need one more for the future, but... Once you got four Thunder Surges, man, like, you're good. With five Attack Haste, you can just spam them over and over again. It's wonderful. Oh, hey, Peter Pan, what's up? Hook never had us any interest in treasure. Ever any interesting treasure? Where's the fun in swiping the same old jewels and gold all the time? Well, if you can't buy anything with it, I guess that, that makes sense. Uh, what can we sell for money that I'm actually willing to part with? I'm sure you would buy my Mega Flare for a bunch, but I'm not, that's not for sale. Oh, I know, also my Blizzard Edge that I accidentally made. <laughs> yeah, this seems like a good deal. And I have se oh my gosh, I have 700. That's exactly enough for a Thunder Surge. I am now completely broke, but I don't even care. <laughs> also, uh, looking at our abilities that we have missing, we need one more Lucky Strike, we need two more Treasure Magnets, two more Item Boosts, one more finish boost, two fire screen, blizzard screen, okay. Two more combo pluses, one more air combo plus. I'm trying to think of basically the cheapest ways that I can just meld commands together in order to get those last few abilities. All right, well, we still haven't completely completed the grind, but at this point, we have pretty much every single command in the game. If we take a look at our reports, with the command collection, we have all the attack commands and all the magic commands. We're missing some ice cream, we're missing the friendship commands, we are missing aerial recovery, which we need to get for Mirage Arena, we're missing the ultimate shot lock, and then we still need to level up the Pete D-Link and get all of the finish commands. Other than that, though, we, and we also need to get the remaining abilities. Other than that, we should be good to go, and then we can go and clear the game. And I'm also debating just clearing the game and then finishing Ventus's story by doing the grinding so we're not super overleveled for the final boss, but honestly, at this point, I don't think it particularly matters. The final boss is actually fairly tricky even if you are overleveled, so it should be fine. Thanks for watching, everybody. Tune in next time. Probably a lot of grinding that'll be done off that'll be done off screen, and who knows, we might even end up finishing the game. So, or by that I mean Ventus's story. Look forward to that next time. Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day, and God bless.